The many ways in which Canada changed during Stephen Harper's nearly 10 years in power have been documented, but the man himself has remained a bit of a mystery. With impressive access, John Ibbotson writes a remarkable biography that puts us inside Harper's head during some of the most critical moments of his life, from his decision to drop out of university, to his tumultuous relationship with Preston Manning, from his first date with Laureen, to his majority win. Harper is captured magnificently in this gripping read for all Canadians. Stephen Harper is hard to know. I think Canadians, even though he led this country for 10 years, uh, he remains a mystery. Without a doubt, Stephen Harper is going to be remembered as one of the most influential and important prime ministers that Canada has ever had. I think that this book is so important because it provides a fuller story of the road that Harper had to power. And that road began long before he was ever involved in politics. I had one hunch, which was that if I could figure out why Stephen Harper quit university after only two weeks and then didn't go back to university for three long years, if I could understand why he did that, I would understand a lot. He portrays Mr. Harper as an extraordinary, ordinary person. And I mean that in a very positive sense. If the reader closes the book and says, all right, I understand Stephen Harper now, I get him, then the book has done its job. They may not like him more, they might not like him less, but if they understand him, then I've written the book I wanted to write.